Dr. Plewood is very quiet, but funny, uh, soft-spoken, very gentle, um, very methodical. As is Dr. Adros, I guess. He's a little more boisterous and, you know, a little, not loud, but you no, know, he's, a, he's a nice guy. He's just a regular guy. I come for cleaning regularly. I've had fillings. I haven't had a root canal yet, but I'm sure looking forward to that. That's why I come here. I mean, people are so friendly, and uh, they make you feel very comfortable here, very thorough, very professional. I just feel easy coming here. It's very easy to come. To, I mean, most people don't like the dentist. This is easy for me to come here. My whole family comes here. My wife and both children come here. Everybody feels comfortable coming here. They're just easy people to talk to. Uh, they just make you feel at ease and comfortable. Yeah, we come in, we talk. I usually come in early just to talk to them for 15, 20 minutes to see how things are going, they ask how the family's going. My son's in the Army, so they always ask how he's doing. Um, they're very, but they're very professional. Don't get me wrong. They, they, they're friendly, easygoing, but they're very professional and they're very good at what they do. They always call to make sure you know your appointment, because I always forget. They'll always call a couple days in advance, uh, make sure you know your appointment, what time, are you coming in, can you make, you know. And, and they're just, it's like a friend calling you to say, hey, we're going to the ball game. I suppose without oral health, it affects so many other things. I mean, you have a bad tooth. Now your neck starts to hurt, you're getting headaches. It's, it's a, I think it's a whole body thing. I think oral health is really important. Probably the most important thing. You start having decaying teeth, it affects a lot more than just your teeth. You're tucking gums and... So we want to, I want to keep my teeth as long as I can keep them.